morning guys December 7 2023 I got a call from a guy there's a couple of towns down um, he's got no heat he's got a gas boiler I was there probably six months ago and I changed the thermal couple on the gas boiler for the guy and he seems pretty knowledgeable he tried um, you know hitting the, the rollout switches and he tried playing around with a vent damper and uh, it's not firing the pilot is on so, you know, unless I go there and check for voltage, it's hard to tell what's going on with it. Could be a control, could be a gas valve, it could be one of them rollout switches that is gone. But anyway, I'm going over there. It's probably like quarter past three in the afternoon. It's pretty cold today. I said it's like 40 in the house, so. Um, he's probably going there for a long weekend. It's Thursday afternoon, right? Oh, he's got no heat. I'm going the there now. To he's a pretty good guy. I've worked for him before. And got a couple of dogs. And, um, try to get you some shots when I get over there. I know it's a PLS gas boiler on a, on a ground into a chimney. 80 plus gas boiler. So I should have whatever I need to fix that thing in the truck. Gas valves and controls and it was the vent damper, I'll rip that sucker right out and jump it out. As long as it doesn't have a... Um... Sometimes you can't, sometimes it's in the Molex plug, you know, that's a problem. Uh, in the gas control, the Molex plug, where the, where the vent damper plugs in, sometimes that's an issue. Anyway, we'll try to we'll try to figure it out, and, uh, get him some heat going. Said it's 40 in the house, so that's not too warm. Gonna, you know, if it's not that cold, I would make him wait for the morning, but seeing it's cold, and we want the house to freeze on him. We're on our way. We're on our way. Never a dull moment, Mama. Never a dull moment. It's off on high limit. It's off on high limit. I just turned it up, and she fired. Cause you see the so what's probably happening is the feeder was stuck, right? Might have to purge it. The feeder was stuck. Okay. So it was running, but it's probably airbound because you're not getting any water, right? This this was calling. That's it. I turned it up. It was it was too low. It was on. Uh, and I never touched that. Just well, I mean, it was. What's it at right now? What one? One sixty. It was off on one sixty, the high limit. So I turned it up where it should be. And it should go up to one eighty, and we're gonna find out why it's not circulating. Turn them all up. We got three zones there. Four zones. Three uh, zones. No, one's hot water. All right. One. This one's working. They're both on. Alright, so let's see if it starts coming back warm. And this feeder was stuck when I came here. Yeah, and I haven't been here for mm. a week. I came, showed up today. The uh, the pipe was warm, but nothing was happening. It was, it was 48 degrees upstairs. Yeah, so it's got nothing to do with the... <sighs> on the first floor or second floor? Both. 40, 48, no, actually 48 on the second, 55 on the first. Yeah, this might have just been, uh, you know, it might be airbound. I might have to purge the zones. We'll see if they start coming back warm. We're already starting to come back warm now. Yep, that second floor one is. And that's the one that's been running, right? The second floor one. Second floor was not, it was 48 degrees. Well, this one's coming back warm now. This is coming back warm now. Give it some time, might have to purge the zones. Is there any freeze in the system? Are you not sure? No, definitely not. I don't, I don't, I never put it in. Could be worse. Could need parts. Cost you money. Right? There you go, my friend. Oh, oh, yeah, let's do that while I'm here. Let's do it. 
Why not? We'll do the first and second. Encourage them. The second floor one. Let's do this one. While we're here. That other one there is a storage tank. We shouldn't have to do that, but let's just shut that one off for now. So that was just stuck. Definitely air in it. Full of air. Look at that. Full of air. Look at it. That's, That's what the problem was. We got a good flow now. The feeder was stuck. I'm telling the ears out by just putting your hand on the hose. Alright, we'll do this next one here, this first one one on here. You watching what I'm doing here now? I am. Well, I had to shut all the valves off on a return, and then we're doing one zone at a time. It just goes through the house and comes out there. Yeah, because I got the valve off, so it's going in the supply, right? Yep. And then up through and back. Once this is open, we could open this feeder. I usually just put my hand on the on the pipe and I could feel if there's any air on it coming out. The feeder was stuck. You weren't I didn't have any pressure in the boiler. There we go. So you push that down before you shut it off. Alright, well it should be good. We should open these valves and we should be ready to rock. <laughs> we should get some heat. The limit was too low. And you didn't have any water in the boiler. Any rocket science? No, and I thought it was something electrical. That's not. So this right here, do I have to ever do anything to it? No. Um, you look at the gauge here. See, we're, we're about 12 pounds, 15 pounds. And that was zero. That was zero. So when I came here, I seen that. I flicked this up and it started, I heard it start feeding. Just to flick it up because it gets it gets shit in there, it gets stuck. Mm -hmm. So as soon as I flipped that up, I started feeding, then the pressure in the boiler come up. Then I noticed that it was set at 160. So I turned the limit up to where it should be. And I've never touched that. So, so that the, 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 the limit's only been coming up to 160 this whole time. So it'll probably come up to 200 or so now. It's set for 200. So the hot water is going to be hotter. I have no little kids, so... Well, you might have to adjust that, but... but that's where I do it. No, you don't touch this. You adjust the hot water over here at the thermostat. See the front thing here? Okay, yeah, yeah. <laughs> right here. Gotcha. That's how you set it on this one. What's it on? It should be on pretty much normal where it needs to be. You could set that the... Uh, um... Yeah, it's on 130. Is that low or high? Is that good? That's right where it should be. See that big knob there? Yep. That's 130. That's one it says 140 down below. It should be right where it is. Okay. So good. if you want it cooler, you turn this down. If you want it hotter, you turn it up. It was it was actually a little hotter than uh that's where it was, right there. Should I ever stick a hose to the bottom drain? No. Okay. If there's any schmutz in the <sighs> Oh, this is one of those. Yeah, she's starting to come back warm now. Well, this one not so much yet. To give it a little bit, cause I just purged it. I got all my zones. Unless the circulator's bad. Let's give it a minute. Circulator's pretty flipping hot. And is that blood well, they've probably been running for for a flipping week trying to heat up the house. So this, yeah, this one's starting to come back. So second and first should start coming back warm. No, I'll give it a minute. You want to go run some hot water just to make sure? No. I shouldn't have to worry about that one, but give it a minute. 
Does this dip of the color make any difference? Is this older? Is this newer? No, it's just uh, that's the one that comes with the boiler. It comes with a black one. Okay. So that's why it's different color. It comes with a black circulator. This is, yep, all right, they're coming back. Feel them too, they're starting to come back warm now. That's the return, Ooh, that's awesome. okay? Yep. I can put your cover back. I mean, it could have been worse. Could have needed a control or a gas valve, you know? It just sucks to have you come out here, but whatever. Well, I'm sorry, man. No, I'm not worried about it. All right, free, uh, feed is stuck, freed up. Reset high limit, purge zones, added water to boiler. And she's she's coming back nice and toasty there, right? So we're good. When I'm not here for a week, I leave the 